Now what if we wanted to have the user input uh, decimal numbers or floating point numbers and then add those together? Well, we wouldn't want to use the parse int command in this case. So if we were going to allow, this, allow people to, to use uh, decimal numbers, we would need to use the parse float command. So this is very simple. I'm just going to uh, modify the JS09A script that we uh, worked on and saved earlier. And I'm going to change parse int to parse float. Okay, and that's all the changes that we're going to make here. Um, so I'm going to save this out as uh, JS09B. And I'm going to save this. And we're going to take JS09D here. I'm going to uh, get that here and pop this over into Internet Explorer. And we'll enter in a number such as 30.33. And then I'm going to add a second number, which is going to be uh, 19.001 and click OK. And sure enough, then the uh, Internet Explorer here returns the value, or JavaScript returns the value 49.331, which is the proper end result of that addition. So if you're working with decimals, then you need to use parse float. Um, these are also known, uh, by the way, as real numbers.